All right, guys, here you go. How to make you a flash. It's real easy. Now, here's a camera. Old Kodak, one of them disposables. Now, if you want to, you can go to a drugstore and say, hey, give me one of them every time you, uh, you know, you, you don't use it because they throw them away. Big waste, all right? So here, all you do, it's got a little plastic tab. You just take that puppy apart. Okay? And in here, you're going to find the guts. And that just slides out right there. And you can get rid of that stuff. It's gone away. And here's what you're left with. Now, on this particular model, you had to push it to get the flash to charge up. So I jumper that out. But what I'm going to do now is run this and slice that there, run that to a micro switch so when the barrel's in the all full posi fully forward position, it'll charge. That'll keep it from shooting when it doesn't recoil, when it recoils, so it doesn't shoot again once it comes back to battery and passes over the firing one. Now right here is where I took out the strobe. You can see it was soldered here. You see that? It was soldered here, here. And there's a little bitty trigger wire right there. You got to solder that on. I'll show you all how to do that here in one second. Alrighty, fellers. Now the first thing I did is took off the battery holder. The battery holder was in here. Solder here and here. I just took that little piece of trash off there. Put two wires. Ran it to a, a AA battery holder. Now this is going to be cut here, and that's going to the switch up there, you know, in the top of the turret there where you turn on your airsoft gun, turn that on and off. I'm going to put that up there. So that'll be cut going right there. All right. So once again, you just solder your positive and your negative, take it to a double-A battery holder. Piece of cake. Now the way the camera operates is, this is the shutter. The shutter is connected right here to a spring. It's pretty tricky. Is this camera, as you push the button, fire that uh, camera off, it moves that shutter. And as that mo shutter moves, there's a spring in there that contacts these two points here. And this is what discharges that stroke. We're going to cut these down. We're going to replace that with a micro switch that goes over here so that when the barrel recoils, it's going to operate that micro switch and shoot it. Okie dokie, here we go. We got it all wired up. Got the battery installed right there. You can see the charge light is on. Now, this is going to be your micro switch. Actually, this is a jumper. But uh, this is going to be the, the, the micro switch there in the can. As the can starts to recoil, it's going to trip this light. Now, take a look. See that? One more time. Just for fun. Now here's something I want to show you. Okay, see? Battery gone. Lights out, right? Am I safe? No. You still got to discharge that capacitor. If you don't, you can get yourself hurt. So watch. Y'all have fun with this. Y'all be careful. What am I doing? 